We are back. Yes, sir. Welcome back to Gen 9 OU. We are here after the brand new sleep claws that have just moved in and banned sleep overall. So yeah, make sure, make sure you like and subscribe for more content like this. And you know, make sure we, I can make more videos like this. But yeah, let's see if Tyranitar, Magnezone, hmm. I'm guessing they most likely will go for a Magnezone first. I'm gonna go Iron Valiant. Oh, they want to go Scizor first overall. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Thunderbolt on the Bullet Punch and see if we can try to cook from there. If they go to Dug Trio, I'm happy with that. But uh, if they do go to Magnezone, I don't really mind. I mean, it's Bullet Punch, it's Scizor. What do you want to do about it? I did make a big goop because I know Scizor could be a good lead. I thought, oh yeah, maybe uh, Magnuson would be funny or whatever. If you get the Thunderbolt, they might have a, oh, oh, yep, it's, it's choice banned, so that's dangerous. So they go to Tyranitar, which I'm happy with. I'm going to go for, I'm going to go Moonblast first. There's a potential chip damage. Wait, I realize they have Earthquake. Not only that, but I'm much faster than most of their Pokemon in the team. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go with Lola Mola. I guess I'm faster than pretty much everything on their team, so it's not really worth it to keep the speed boost. Let's see. As they go to Doug Trio, absolutely amazing. So I'm going to flip turn now. As they go to Magnezone, boom, get some damage off. What I'm going to do is this. I'm going to go for a Dalton Fire for some potential damage on the Magnezone. I'm going to go Dragon Dance, as that probably might go Trick. No, they don't even have a Trick. <laughs> they don't even have a Trick. As they go to Doug Trio, and... If they are not Scarf, we do outspeed, and they don't have a, they don't have the potential of a Arena Trap. So there it is. You got Duck Trio down, and now we get more Sand Chip, which I don't really mind because that means you can't rid of Stealth Rocks. The only thing that's a big worry is Tyranitar. So I'm gonna go Earthquake now, get some damage off on the Tyranitar, as it is bulky Tyranitar. So you have two turns left of Sand. So I'm gonna go for uh, another Earthquake, as they go for more Chip damage. I think they most likely are going to be Terra. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Earthquake again. No, they're not Terra. I'm surprised. I was like, oh yeah, they could do all that. But they have Krakowal back on the field. Um, hmm. I'm going to go Heat Crash again. Give some chip. I'm going to go Aqua Step for speed boost, which I don't really mind because now I still outspeed overall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Dragon Claw for stab damage and see what it can do from there. It is a non-resistant damage, and not only that, but uh, the only, that's the only thing that doesn't really resist other than Tyranitar, so they have that for sure. They probably most likely don't want to deal with the likes of a uh, of Tyranit. Well, they don't want to deal with my Galgic Fire on their steals, and it looks like uh, you know, I think it'll clean up the rest of the game if they're not very careful. So you see, the Galgic Fire is, of course, having a you know outspeeding Great Tusk by plus one after a dragon dance so let's see are they going to move on are they going to you know see from there because i really they forfeit oh yeah they do forfeit unfortunate that they kind of uh lost their step with that i mean i, I mean having this team i say it, it's really really weak to gouging fire but uh let's move on to our next game and see if we could try to do something from there this screams dark and Nackle. This screams big stall. So what I'm gonna do now is uh, they don't have an unaware mon. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go Iron Crown since they have no potential uh, Pokemon to you know take the damage. So I'm gonna do that. They go Nacrosec, which I don't mind. I go well. I'm gonna go Amoongus now. As they probably might go Salt Cure for chip damage. So I'm gonna do that. I don't really mind the Salt Cure, so I can go Giga Drain now. As it goes Stealth Rock for no uh, spin. My bad for the fast forward, but look at that. We're giving some chip damage. So if they go Torn, well, you know what? If they go Torn, I'm going to go uh, Toxic on them. They do recover. Bad move on my part, but I did want to predict the uh, I'm Torn, so that's that's my fault. Oh, uh-oh. Yeah, I mean, I just recently got this new computer, so... I mean, I'm happy I got the new computer. It's, you know, better off than my old computer. But look at this from right here. We have the Nacrosac. 
it is gone through the Moongus. I get Giga Drain back off, get some recovery. Sure, we're getting chipped, but uh, I'd much rather not have to recover off than anything. So, get more chip damage, boom. 65. So, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go Toxic and uh, let's see if they could go for another move. I'm probably guessing they might go. Uh oh. Okay, they go Torn, which I'm happy that I got that, but yeah, that's my bad. Still getting used to the old quirks in the computer. That's what my, my jaw is. But let me get the regenerator off. They go U-turn. They probably might go knackle stack again as they do that. I'm going to go flip turn to they can't get burnt. I'm going to do that. And I'm going to go back to my own Amoongus and see. There we go. As they go back to Salt Cure. Nope, they recover. I don't really mind that. I'm just going to go that. And they go their Tornado Therian, which I don't really care for. I'm going to go back to Alola Mola for some chip damage as they go Bleak Wind Storm, which is absolutely amazing. I'm going to go Wish now as they go in new turn. So they probably might go Quavel or Incineroar or even Garchomp from the likes of it. I'm guessing Garchomp is their best answer. Let's see. They go Nacrosac, which I don't really mind it because I have Wish. And what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to go Flip Turn now. Oh, my bad. That's the double click feature. Let's see. What I'm gonna do is, uh, hmm. I'm gonna go to Iron Valiant. Why am I double clicking? But yeah, there's Iron Valiant back. Let's see, get the Quark Drive, which I don't really care about. They do Salt Cure. It's gonna be 1 8th. And as we do that, boom, you get the 1 8th damage. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go uh, Roar Spear now. As, if they do Terra, as they're too, if they're scared to even Terra, I don't mind that. As they go Toxic Pex, I really don't mind it at all. I mean, they can't haze, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Terra Electric and Thunderbolt and see if we can do something from there. Boom, damage off. Let's see, Toxic Spikes, which I don't really mind since I have Amoongus, but I'm guessing it won't work out due to the Amoongus having heavy duty boost. But let's see if we can try to cook. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna go from there. Let's see, if Iron Valiant does all that, then they go, they go to an Aqua Stack, which I don't mind. More chip damage. I'm gonna go to another Thunder. Well, probably go Garchomp, so I'm gonna go Moonblast. Then I'm going to a Roar Sphere now because uh, to predict the potential of a Garchomp or a Cineroar. Or even Quavo will be a perfect predict too. So I'm definitely gonna try this out. Unfortunately, we won't have Terra Blast on the Iron Crown, but uh. You know, that's perfectly fine with me. I'm going Aurora Sphere now. I'm guessing now they're probably going to go Toxapex, I'm guessing, or Tornadus, or even Incineroar. They do go Toxapex. I'm guessing they're going to go Baneful Bunker. No, they go Tornadus, which I get a lot of chip off, and we do get rid of them from the Toxic chip, which is really amazing. So they're down two Mons. The problem might go Baneful Bunker this turn, if I'm, if I'm, not, if I'm not wrong. Let's see. Let's see, we get some Thunderbolt damage off, and hopefully we get some uh, uh, some good chip in. Let's see. Hmm. Oof. Yeah, there's Baneful Bunker. The only way they can possibly uh, defeat me now is the possibility of uh, two Baneful Bunkers, but hopefully it doesn't work out. Terra Poison, smart. Perilous, but that's that's horrible on my part. But that's horrible on their part, my bad. But let's go Moongus and see. Let's see. There it is. So boots do work on this thing. So I'm gonna go Lola Mola now. As uh, you know, poison types don't work. And I do have the potential chip on that. So what I'm gonna do is uh hmm. You know what? I'm gonna wish out. They might switch to Garchomp, which I don't really care. Or they go to uh, quick waffle. but uh, let's see if how we can try to use Dark Rye or Amoongus. But Amoongus is doing a lot of work, so we do get the wish off. So we did predict the Baneful Bunker on them, which is fine by me. They go Garchomp, which I'm gonna go with Lola Mola, get some chip damage. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Amoongus, you know, there's that, and I'm gonna go Toxic now. If they don't go Toxapex, then that's easy chip for me. I'm guessing most likely to go Earthquake. Perfect. So I'm going to Toxic them. Get some damage off. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go switch back out to Alola Mola. 
and they go Swords Dance, which I don't really mind. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Wish. If they do Scale Shot, okay, they probably might be loaded dice. Let's see, three, four. Yeah, there's the. It might be loaded dice. So what I'm gonna do now is get more Poison Chip off. So I'm gonna do this. They probably go Swords Dance. No, they will go for that you know, damage point. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go Iron Crown as they get, we do get rid of them from poison. Let's see, one, two, three, four. Perfect, this is probably a, this is most likely a loaded dice. They're trying to get rid of that. So I'm fine with this, I'm happy. So they go quick quavel. I'm gonna go back to Amoongus, just for some chip damage and stuff, just in case you turn, there it is. They go with Cinnaroar, which I'm perfectly fine with. As I go to my Molo Mola, Get some full regenerator chip off and they do parting shot. Mm hmm. They do that and they have a, a non regenerator uh, Toxapex, which is fine by me, which they forfeit, unfortunately. But a very good draft league team, it seems. It's just unfortunate that, uh, you know, I have a very good team along with it. So, with the regenerator core as well. So, let's move on to our next game and see if we can try at least do something with Darkrai because Lumungus did a lot of work on this team. Toxicing the Darchomp, trying to get rid of the Nagosag, doing a lot of chip, and Toxicing the Tornadus, which really helped with the assist for, for Iron Valiant. So let's see if we can move on to our next game and play it out. Alrighty, so we got an Agency fan, Blunder indeed. So it seems like there might be either Gliscor lead or going to be um, Ogre Pond. I think it's going to be either Gliscor, Ogre Pond, or Superior. I'm probably going to go for... Which one has knockoff? I don't think it has knockoff. You know what? You know what? Go, I'll go for it. I'm going to go uh, Iron Crown Sweep and see if you could definitely do some shenanigans. I mean, Great Tusk could be a good lead as well with a Stab Earthquake. They go Ogre Pond, which I don't mind at all. What I'm going to do is Agility. Up. Oh, let's see. I'm guessing they might go Volcarona. Oh, my bad. They probably go Gliscor, perfect. So I'm gonna go Agility, which completely outspeeds all their Pokemon and stuff. Uh, I'm guessing there might be a, a very high attack investment Earthquake, so it's called Mine. There we go. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a, that probably would've killed me right there. So do that, they probably go Toxic Poison, which I don't mind. So I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna go Store Power now. Oh, they predicted me hard. So I'm gonna do this. Let me go for the store power now. Oh. Oh, they're goobing, they're goobing me really hard. So yeah. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna Terra Blast, sure they'll sucker punch me, but now I'll go with my Iron Valiant switch in. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Roar Sphere. Light score, perfect choice. As I go now to a Moon Blast, as they will probably protect for potential chip damage. Nope, they will want to go for a Toxic correct yes sir so to do that i'm gonna go uh i'm gonna go for a potential banter and go for shadow ball i'm gonna go moon blast just to save my power points that's why i'm trying to save my power points and stuff i'm guessing they might go volcarona most likely next up so i'm just gonna watch out for that but uh lola mola could do a lot of work on this or even dark Rai, even without terra so we do get the glide score damage off they will they want to use their spikes which i don't mind so i'm gonna go with thunderbolt again for banter as they realize oh shoot we have a uh, he's wasting time so i'm gonna do this sure i might get knocked out after this turn but it is what it is at this point i'm doing a lot of damage on the iron valiant there we go boom tip damage again as they will go for a quiver dance i'm gonna go thunderbolt before they do that they go fiery dance which i don't think is a smart decision Bad than that, so as a, you know what? I'm gonna do this. It's not really smart, but I'm gonna go Dragon Dance as a. They will go, uh, go Terra Ground, Terra Blast. Oh, right. Okay, this is absolutely bad. This is probably the worst case scenario, but good thing is that we have Dark Ride to do all that. There it is. And now it's probably over. <laughs> it's probably over, over, over. Yeah, I should. I definitely got goob goob, uber goob. Let's see. Ah, yeah. GG's.
Yeah, GG CNM, I got Uber Groove. Yeah, it's that frame for sure. I should not have a uh, try to go. Yeah, so we have that. Um, we have that for sure. Sure, I'm guessing this is an ADC fan, but I'm gonna have to move on to the next game. I did goob on the Iron Crown. Should not have lead out and stuff for the um, Ogre Pond lead, but it is what it is at this point. I'm gonna go for a. I'm gonna go for the, my final game and hopefully I can win this one out and see. It is a Cleavor lead most likely, so I'm gonna go with Lola Mola for the lead. Cleavor lead. Ah, quick double clicking. There's Cleavor. What I'm gonna do first is I'm going to Scald. I'm no, I'm gonna be slower for sure. I'm gonna be slower for sure on the on the Cleavor. So they go Rotom Wash. I don't mind that. If we do get a burn, I'm happy with it, but never mind. So what I'm gonna do is uh hmm. They might go electric move. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go gouging fire for the potential volt switch. As they go Thunder Wave. Very bad on my part. I thought they would probably go Will O Wisp. It is what it is at this point. They go Volt Switch. I'm gonna go for a Dragon Dance. As they have that. So this is very bad on my part, which I do not expect having to deal with the, uh, they do that. What I'm gonna do now is, uh, since I'm probably uber grooved, I'm probably gonna go for a Lola Mola in case for the potential of a stone ax, there it is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go uh, flip turn on the potential Rotom Wash, there we go. Chip damage number one, there we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Amongus now. I should have done this in the first place. Here's what it is at this point. I'm going to go Toxic, just in case if they want to swap out. If not, then Rotom would be absolutely perfect. The only big problem would be was Goldingo, which I'm guessing they would probably want to do that. They probably want to go Goldingo. Obviously, that's the very, you know, no brain type of option. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, back to uh, Lola Mola, and I'm going to go Flip Turn. Let's go. Dango's a really good Pokemon and should not be messed around with like that. I should not be messing around with this thing. Of course, the, you know, if you heard the chart of mess around, find out, they said. Yeah, there it is. So we popped the balloon on Goldango. I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to go gouging fire. I'm probably might get knocked out, but I'm going to go earthquake just to, you know, let one finishing blow off before anything happens. They go Cleavor, but that's fine by me. I'm happy with it. So I'm gonna go uh, another, I'm gonna go Heat Crash as they miss another Stone Axe. I am so sorry for the person that's been dealing with these type of stuff. I am. I feel bad for them. They lost their, uh, they lost their, but uh, there it is. So there, there is that. So I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna go Among Us now on the Switch. Very unfortunate. So what I'm going to do now is on the Goldingo switch, I'm going to go uh, Iron Crown and see. There's that. Boom. It might go. Uh oh, yeah, there it is. But they want to go Miascarada now. What I'm going to do is, uh, hmm. I'm going to go Terror Fighting Agility as I want to go knock off. That's fine by me. We do get the weakness policy out. We do get the agility. Boom. And now I can calm mine as they might want to go uh, swap out or they want to go for a potential move. So either that or they're probably going to go Goldengo. Like I thought, they go Goldengo. I do get a special defense boost. So what I'm going to do is do another calm mine. They probably might go Thunder Wave if I'm thinking they're probably going to do that. Right? There's Nasty Plot, which I'm fine with. I don't think I have the power. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm going to go another... Uh, I'm going to go store Power. Hopefully that knocks it out. Nope, it doesn't. As they want to go greedy, that's a perfect play for Iron Crown. I mean, Iron Crown is doing really well after the after this. But I do think they're going Miascarada for the chip damage. That That's fine by me. So I'm going to go Terra Blast. Basically, I'm just trying to help clean up the game for a Dark Cry if needed. So if they want to go Entai for extreme speed, I don't mind that at all. Because I do have the defense. And from right here, we do have to cage in EV spreads with Iron Crown with 337 HP. 
But uh, let's see if we can try to finish off this uh, this team. It looks like they have the Goldango with a little, very little ship left. We have Great Tusk, and see from there. Hopefully, uh, well, they're gonna try to finish, but I'm guessing they might. Oh wait, they left. They left. Their man's is like, nah, man. I miss my uh, I miss my uh, my stone axes. I miss my stuff. But you know, this is not a very good last game. So what I'm gonna do is uh. I'm gonna move on to the next game if uh if they want to continue doing whatever. So what I'm gonna do is uh I'm gonna play my my last game. So it's probably about a minute or so. But yeah, look at that. This is, might be a draft league team with a revival blessing. It looks like. So what I'm gonna do is uh hmm, this team gets uh, destroyed by uh, the likes of Darkrai, but uh, we try to see if we can try to cook. Dark Pulse. They have a Sludge Bomb. Ice beam for the this team's good, but I'm guessing it's the draft league team, so I'm gonna watch out. As they go to their uh, Gyarados, I don't mind that. I'm gonna go to a Scald and see if we could try to burn the Gyarados as they go Dragon Dance. They have Quick Claw, so they obviously are a Dragon Dance, uh, not a Dragon Dance. They are obviously are a they're obviously are a draft league team because it, there's no obvious way that probably would use a Dragon Dance unless they have a. Unless they want to go for a quick claw. Thunderbolt on the... Uh-oh. We do get the burn, which I'm like that. But, uh, not like, I'm not like that. But I'm just saying, like, I like it. Like, in a way. We go Moongus on the switch. Psych. My guy, chill. Nobody wants to get all that hacks, son. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Dragon Dance on the move. As you go to Gyarados, I don't mind that, which I'm going to go uh, Dragon Dance. If you want to go Thunder Wave, I'll go back to my Amoongus. There it is. And there you go, Thunder Wave, which I'm happy about on the Amoongus. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Toxic, as they might want to go Ice Fang. Let's see. There we go. We got Toxic, which I don't mind at all. We do get rid of the Gyarados. It's Quick Claw shenanigans so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go back to lola mola as they go back to their quick claw and they want to go ice fang again which i don't even mind at all so they want to go back to their mew which i'm going to do is i'm going to play a funny play and uh i'm guessing they might want to go for another uh ice move or they want to go something else they'll probably go crunch okay more toxic chip i don't mind that and they might want to go back to uh i'm gonna lola mola for the thunder wave there it is so you get more toxic chip, which I'm happy about. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wish as I want to go crunch, and then I'm gonna go back to a. So that the, I mean, I'm like, oh no, I'm getting hacks. <laughs> but yeah, look at that. We we are gonna. So Gyarados is one thing. Tyranitar would definitely be a fun Pokemon to take out. But once you get rid of Tyranitar, Tinkaton, and even the likes of Palmot, I think we can sweep through the rest of the thing with Darkrai. Perfectly fine with me. I'm gonna go. Uh, so you do that. I'm gonna go to a. Uh, I'm gonna wish. I'm gonna wish now. As you want to keep thunderbolting or ice beaming with Mew, I'm guessing I'm gonna go gouging fire. You go ice beam, perfect. I mean, there it is. More. Uh, there's wish support. Now I'm gonna go. Uh, you have that. I'm gonna go dragon dance. If you are thunder wave, well played. If you're not are, if you're not a uh, dragon, no, if you're not a uh, thunder wave, and I'm surprised. So they are, they're trying to chip it down, which I don't mind. I'm gonna go for a heat crash now. Very bad move on their part for bringing Gyarados in. And, you know, nope, never mind. What I'm gonna do now is Dragon Claw, finish off the Gyarados, which I'm happy about, which uh, has a very annoying Pokemon to deal with. And I'm gonna go Earthquake on the Gouging Fire, which of course they get a lot of chip off, which Dragon Tail, oh, that's bad. I'm sorry, man. I am so sorry for that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go one more earthquake. If they want to go Palmot, I don't mind that. If I want to go Raska, that's okay. Or even Tinkaton. But this Monkamon is this team is really weak to earthquake. They're weak to earthquake. They're weak to dark type moves. Which I'm gonna get rid of the Tyranitar, which I'm really happy about, as it helps me out in the Dark Rye end game. Palmot, I am so happy you're here. Give me you. Give me you. I want you. I want you to you know use either Revival Blessing. For you to even get a focus sash. I want to finish you off. Oh. 
I'm like, oh. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Dragon Dance again. Very fair play. Terra Flying. You might be low tier Terra, but I'm going to go another... Oh. You know what? I'm going to go Heat Crash. You might go Revival Blessing, but you know what? I don't care. Because I love it. Ah! Quit double clicking. Oh no! <laughs> but... Oh, we can do it. Oh no, we're gonna play this game. So we have that for sure. But uh this is probably the live I'm gonna do. Uh you know what? They're probably gonna have a thunder wave again, so I'm gonna go to Amoongus now. Let's see. Amoongus. There we go. But uh we do have a thunder wave. So what I'm gonna do now is uh I'm gonna go Dark Rye. Let's see if it doesn't do close combat. There it is. There it is. We do have a Revival Blessing, and we do revive Tyranitar. Which I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna Terra Poison, and I'm gonna Nasty Plot on the likes of, of, of Paul Mott, excuse me. On the likes of Paul Mott, which I'm really happy about. They do get Juggernaut back on the field, which I'm gonna go Terra Poison and Nasty Plot, which I don't mind at all, which if uh, they have leftovers. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna Ice Beam, and I'm gonna do is, you know, get some chip damage off. If they do Dragon Tail, I don't mind that. Oh boy, that's fun. We do get recovery. Um, that does about 25. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swap out to Iron Valiant now. As we do get rid of the, I'm gonna try to get rid of the Tyranitar as they do Dragon Tail. Perfect. We do get the immunity all. Which I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Roar Sphere. If they wanna go a uh, Palmot, I don't mind that at all. If they wanna go a uh, Tinkaton, I don't really care either. Because uh, Tinkaton would be one of the biggest factors in this roster. Even Paul Mod is fine because I have a speed boost, so that means uh, can I get you know I won't get paralyzed if I do Thunderbolt. Wait, I realized it's a uh, Volt Absorb. It's Volt Absorb, so it doesn't do nothing. So what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna go for a Moon Blast on the Paul Mod if they swap it in. If not, then I don't mind at all. But uh, Dark Ride does does have a little bit of health left. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Moon Blast on the Iron Val. Let's see, Chip Damage, Special Attack Drop. I don't mind. And to go with Thunder Wave, I don't mind that either, as uh, we're still outspeeding it, even with a speed boost. Unfortunate, they want to revive back Tyranitar, it seems like. Let's see. They go Gyarados. I don't really care. I mean, I already have an Electric-type move, so... They have. They already see my stab moves. They want to go Tyranitar. I'm going to go Moonblast on the Paul Mott. Fine by me. If they want to go back to Tyranitar, I don't really care, because I have Aurora Sphere. They go Tinkaton. Are they all max? Are they max speed? Let's see. Of course, of course, I lose my. Uh, I'm gonna go Iron Crown. Then I'm gonna go uh, Lola Mola for the potential chip. Well, this is a really good team constructed. It's a revival blessing team, which is really annoying. Which I was guessing that's why a Rask Raska is there. But let's see. There's gonna be a Mew. There's the Mew. Which I'm gonna go for a, I'm gonna go regenerator combo and I'm gonna go Amoongus now. Ice Beam, well played. Psychic, I don't really mind now because I do have regenerator chip. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go Iron Crown. If you are a fire type move, I don't really mind that. I'm gonna go Calm Mind as I am faster than you. Fire Blast, okay. We get the weakness policy off. Which I'm gonna do is now is I'm gonna go, well, I'm gonna go through a, a I'm gonna go Terra Blast. I do get rid of you with that. And now I'm guessing you're going to go Tyranitar from the likes of it. So I'm I'm obviously faster than the rest of your team. So I'm going to do that. You do your Juggernaut. And I'm going to go for a Terra Blast. It doesn't going to do much. It's not going to do much. But at least it's better off. That we're going to sacrifice it rather than trying to do some chip damage it. Okay. There it is. We did knock it out with Earthquake. Which uh, I don't mind at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap to my Lola Mola. I'm going to scald it for some chip damage. If they go with Tinkaton, I don't mind that at all. But uh, let's get some chip damage off. They go to their Blue Beetle. Why am I getting Parahack so much? Oh, God. I'm double clicking, too. They go Revival Blessing. And they ate a Leopard Baby. This is so annoying. But this is good that at least we have that. They have 12%. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Wish. They go Revival Blessing to get their Gyarados back, which is a really annoying thing. And we are getting para, it's para spam. We get it rest. I don't mind that, which uh, 
I could finally wish. I could finally flip turn. Oh, I hate this type of set. Ah! Now I'm gonna go dark grind now on the field. So I'm gonna do that. Get some. Gets a lot of good. Uh, do that. And bad dreams is back. So we do have that. But I'm gonna go nasty plot and get some uh, potential chip on the Tyranitar. But everybody is at 50 now. So don't mind that. I'm gonna go nasty plot and I'm gonna go stab dark boss. Of course you are quick claw. Of course you are. No wonder why you're so good at the game. Yeah, I'm letting it out, but, you know, I'm probably done for. There it is. GG's. GG's. Good. But very. Well played. They have that. I'm gonna go wish on the play. If I do get paralyzed, I mean, it, I mean, I'm getting para hacks all this game, so it is what it is at this point. Get a wish off. Hopefully, you're protect for some chip damage. I mean, I'm already done for. So this is like already. I'm gonna wish again. They probably might finish me off with thunderbolt most likely. Look at that. Yeah, there it is. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just forfeit for right now. Well, I'm not gonna forfeit. I mean, GGs to them. Well played. I mean, I got goobed up with this revival blessing team. So let's move on to an actual final game. Another draft league team. Well, grasp, you know, type of thing. But man, I'm hating these draft league teams. But I mean, that's what you get at the low ladder when you try to do an alt. But let's move on. Let's see. We get the roller boom, which I'm happy about. So what I'm gonna do is uh. I might go, I'm gonna go to Dragon Dance now. If you high horsepower, well played. They go Dondozo, which I don't mind at all. I'm gonna go with my Amoongus now, as you wanna go for Dondozo. Do that, Body Slam. Oh, there it is. Another Parahax mod. So we're gonna have more Parahax to deal with. That'll be fun. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, I'm gonna go Giga Train. If you wanna go for a uh, Lola Muck, Torterra, I don't mind at all. Boom, some chip damage. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go clear a smog since I'm slower. And you wanna go shell smash? I could definitely clear it up right now. Let's see. There it is. We get rid of their uh we get rid of their stats. So you have that, which I'm happy about. So if they want to go shell smash again. I don't mind that. They go shell smash, boom. Let's see if we get some more chip damage off the on the clear smog. There it is. Boom. We get rid of that, which I'm happy about. So I'm gonna finish it off with a Giga Drain if they want to go Shell Smash, which they're probably frustrated enough to, uh, like, you know what? You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna recover. So do that. We have some recovery enough now. I'm guessing they probably might go Don Dozo. They might go Lola Muck. They go Haxorus. Hmm. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Toxic. If they go Terra Poison. Very smart. So what I'm gonna do is uh I'm gonna go Clear a Smog. And hopefully this will help clean up the rest of the game for Darkrai as a uh, well the muck will be a very big problem. So Ice Beam could do some work, but uh if we do get Darkrai back in the field, I'd be happy because uh you know once you get rid of Iron Hands, once you get rid of all those threats, we can definitely do some damage. There might I think the Hacksters might go Iron Head, okay. They're not even gonna go for a uh, Terra you know, they're not going to go Poison Jab for the Fairies, which I completely understand. They have a lot of more Pokemon that are Terra of Fairy, and Poison is not a very good uh, offensive type. I'm going to go Gouging Fire. They're not going to go Earthquake, which I don't mind. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Dragon Dance on my own. Well, wait, wait, wait. So I'm going to do is this. I'm going to go Terra Fairy on my uh, Gouging Fire for some chip damage, but Amoongus is doing a lot more work than I need to. So do that. You go Dragon Dance once. I'm going to go for a uh, you know what? I'm gonna go Dragon Claw in case if you want to go for a Poison Jab. Oh, that's bad. So you do have Iron Head and Poison Jab, which I don't really care about at all. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go Iron Valiant. We are now at even speed levels. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go Shadow Ball to get rid of you. And if you want to go Rillaboom, I don't mind. If you want to go with Lola Muck, I don't mind since I'm now faster than your entire team. Unless you have Priority Grassy Glide on Rillaboom, which I don't really care about. So I'm faster than your entire team. So if you want to go Rillaboom, go ahead. I don't think I'm a, any type of KO. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to Moongus. 
sword stance very surprising not surprising for me but uh, i'm gonna go clear smog now if i'm not paralyzed i'm fine get rid of heavy duty boots we do get a red stat boost which i don't mind at all which i'm gonna do now is uh i'm gonna go iron crown for the potential grassy glide or any chip damage let's see go another sword dance what i'm gonna do is uh hmm i'm gonna go to uh the probably might go high horsepower but i'm gonna go agility just in okay yeah that's me being dumb i should have went call mine but even then i'm probably screwed up either way so what i'm gonna do now is uh i'm gonna go moongas again i mean since they can't get rid of my boot i mean they can't get rid of my boots what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna go a little mola if they want to fall for it there you go go uh, high horsepower do that which i'm gonna go uh, protect on the chip damage now i mean i don't really care oh no that's bad so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go Moongus, hopefully. If I if I do fall for it, GG's to them. But uh let's see, go grassy glide, knock off, which I don't really care either. So if you do go for a grassy glide, I don't really mind it because uh your team is either weak to uh, a Moongus or they're weak to Iron Valiant, which I don't really mind. So there you go. Get rid of your grassy terrain. I'm gonna go uh, go for a scald now. If you go for a grassy glide, I don't mind. There it is. We do get rid of that, so let's go dark cry now. And see if you can try to get some uh, potential chip damage. I'm going to go Sludge Bomb. As to go Muckalola. I don't really care about that. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, oh, I'm going to go Moongus. Well, I'm going to go Moongus now. They're probably going to go Knock Off. There it is. As I uh, can't get Poison. So I'm going to go Synthesis. Ice Punch. Oh, boy. I guess it's over. This is all over. One annoying team after another. So I'm going to go Nasty Plot into Dark Cry. Let's see, I'm probably going to get knocked off. We get Drain Punch. Poison, right? There you go. Have that. I'm going to go another Ice Beam on the thing. No Frozen, which is unfortunate. So what I'm going to say, I'm going to say GG's, but, uh, you know, I mean, this is a very unfortunate end, but uh, like I thought, you know, Darkrai is not very good in this type of meta. Darkrai is not very good. I mean, Darkrai is not good. But Amoongus is very good support and has a very good niche, which I really have that as a retrospect is that Amoongus is really good as a good support mod even without sleep. Darkrai is probably going to be UU, which I completely you know think that's the case. But uh, GG's to them. I'm going to move on to whatever recording or life thing I have now. But uh, it is what it is at this point. So GG's to everybody. Sorry for all this stuff. I mean. This is my first video back with the new computer. So hopefully, uh, you know, y'all have a great day. Y'all stay safe. And Bandito out. Yes, sir.